All right, guys, here we are. It is currently 13 degrees in the morning. Uh, I think 7.30 in the morning. I had to get here. Uh, I have the Monster Vigan 90 millimeter ready to go. Um, the forecast looks like it's just, it's just so crappy for the next like five, six days. There's no way I'm gonna be able to focus on anything if I have this thing ready to fly and I don't go up and, uh, and fly it. So uh, yeah, let's, um, let's go ahead and just throw it up. Uh, obviously no one's here. We have light winds, maybe like seven, eight miles an hour. Um, it's really cold though, like I said, 12, 13 degrees and holding this thing is gonna be super difficult. I basically have to hold it by the, the, the hole, the cheater hole in the bottom. So I'm gonna trim this a little bit. <clears throat> uh, I actually don't know where to trim it because I have activated the canards. Uh, yeah, I, I just really hope this thing flies. Um, it's obviously snow on the ground. I don't know how that's gonna how that's gonna impact the landing. I don't know if it's gonna make it dig in, create a lot of friction. Um, I think it's gonna it might hurt it because it's kind of like it's kind of frozen. So let's uh, let's just throw it. I I'm not gonna be able to to wait uh, anymore to do this. So let's just go ahead and uh, and just throw caution to the wind and just chuck it because that's kind of how i roll uh yeah let's just do it uh let me just go control check is good no win currently oh god wow that was freaking hairy but it took off like a rocket. Holy, it is flying awesome. Huh. Wow, dude. Oh, the Monster Vigan flies just like the 64. Look at it. Oh, it's touchy on the roll, okay. The roll is super touchy. Uh, I have to trim or turn down the roll axis big time and my hands are absolutely frozen right now. Uh, oh my God, straight up unlimited vertical. Unlimited vertical guys, oh my God. This thing is crazy. The roll is absolutely bonkers. I wish I had someone here to like help me out. My fingers, I'm literally, I, I have, um, what do you call it? I have drops coming out of my eyes because it's so cold right now and I'm trying to focus. Uh, oh my God. This thing is absolutely out of control. I'm at half throttle the whole time, unless I want to do a high speed pass. Oh, oh, straight up. Oh my God, this thing is crazy. Oh, okay, my thumb, I, 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 can't, I can't control this plane because my thumb is so frozen. I'm gonna, <clears throat> I'm gonna have to bring it in uh, as gently as I can here. Gently as possible, gently. Oh yes! Look at that, guys! <laughs> I gotta go warm my hands up in the car. I left my car running. This thing is freaking crazy. Crazy! Okay, all right, I gotta compose myself a little bit. All right, oh my God. Look at this. So crazy, way, way cooler than I thought it was gonna be. Oh my God. All right, I gotta go. I'm gonna check the voltage of this battery. Uh, kind of see what I what I got. I got uh, like two minutes of flight time because my hands are too cold. And, um, <clears throat> oh my God, I'm snot coming out of my nose. Holy. All right, let me do this. Let me check the voltage. I'm gonna go in the car. I gotta warm my hands up. I'm gonna prepare myself to, uh, 
to to run this thing up one more time i have one more battery here uh oh my god i'm gonna get frostbite in my hands <sighs> okay i'm gonna leave this out here and i will uh i will come back to you in a second all right all right guys uh just did my first flight with the uh the monster vegan and i've never well okay i have to, i have to rephrase this i have had two to one power to weight ratio aircraft before my fun jets i've had 90 millimeter fun jets so let's just get that straight um i've had i've had more powerful more powerful jets but this is a 3D printed 90 millimeter um, EPF hobby mercury alloy 90 millimeter, and it is, it, it's, I mean, I couldn't even enjoy it because I'm, I was literally tearing, I was snotting. It, it's look, it's 12. You can see that it's 12 degrees Fahrenheit. Um, I had to fly this thing though. I, ha I had to, I had to get it going. Um, it's sitting out there right now on the table um i'm just warming up my hands uh, i gotta get one more flight in before i start the day i'm so happy it flew good um i just feel like um this is this is a, a game changer like the 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 two to one power to weight on a big end it, it floated in for the landing you guys saw that and the and the ice and the snow actually helped it um kind of glide in there and it just it just slid like it was on a runway that was pretty cool so uh all right my hands are just about warm enough now i'm gonna cut this and i'm gonna um i'm gonna go throw up the uh the second uh junk amazon battery it was at um uh 3.9 uh volts uh or whatever it is a cell and um so i probably had another 30 seconds left uh at the most so about three minutes is about what you're gonna get um on a 4000 but I, I gotta get some 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 uh, modern um, 6s packs now and uh, and get this thing really doing some crazy aerobatic okay so I went out there to do my second flight with uh, mr. monster I can't I don't think you can see that it's too dark uh, the monster vegan and it unfortunately something happened to the motor I don't know what the heck happened i mean the thing landed under power i don't know it it's like it's stuttering when i start when i tried to give it throttle i was about to hand launch it it was like stuttering like um it was going like do 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 i the thing usually that means that there's a, a motor wire unplugged so it, it was just it was acting all weird um it could be a speed controller that was uh that was burned up um, I believe it's 150 amp uh, ESC. I'm, I'm not sure. I'm gonna have to try and diagnose it. But listen, I got one flight, and that thing is crazy. I have something to look forward to. I just hope I didn't hurt the motor because you literally can't even get that um, that that EDF anymore. Uh, they're they're all out of stock. I don't even know if they're making them. But uh, okay, so uh, yeah, good flight. Um, I'll put this up on YouTube for you guys. And um, yeah, the 90 millimeter is definitely um, it's definitely worth the print. It's worth the filament. It's uh, it's to have that kind of power. The the vertical power was. Everybody always says, oh, unlimited uh, unlimited vertical. Well, when you have when you have two to one power to weight. It pretty much is unlimited vertical. I mean, I, I went full throttle straight up and it just disappeared. So I um, hope the video can show you that. So that was fun and uh, I'll see you guys, uh, I'll see you guys later.